Hey Drone Nerds, Matt here. If you didn't see our previous mapping mission video where we took the DJI Mavic 3 Enterprise, did an oblique mapping mission, and processed that mission with DJI Terra, I'll link that video in the description. We're back at you today with another oblique mapping mission, except for this mission, we're going to be processing with Pix4D-Matic. Our first step for this mapping mission is we're going to take out the Mavic 3 Enterprise and collect some data. Before we enter the camera view on the DJI Mavic 3 Enterprise, we want to select flight route so we can start planning our mission. We're going to tap the plus sign and create a route. We will select area route because we want to map an area that we select. Next, tap on the map to draw the mapping area. And once you have created the area you would like to map, tap on the check icon. It's going to ask you your aircraft model and what camera you would like to use. Next, we want to make sure that we tap oblique collection. We will also alter the ortho ground sampling distance so the aircraft gets the most detailed images it possibly can. Next, we will adjust the route altitude. And for this mission, we're going to fly at 150 feet. I'm going to set the safe takeoff altitude to 100 feet because in this park, there are some tall light poles that I would like to make sure that the drone clears. I'm also going to set the side overlap ratio and frontal overlap ratio to 75. This will ensure that we get a good quality data set that we can process. We're also going to name our mapping mission. And once we are happy with our parameters, we're going to tap the save icon in the top left. Here, it gives us a breakdown of our flight mission. We can see here that this mapping mission will take just under nine minutes and take 541 photos. Next, we will go through the pre-flight checklist. And once we're happy with that, we will tap next. It will take us to the mapping checklist and we will select upload flight mission. This uploads the mission to the aircraft. And when we're ready to start the mission, we will tap start. Moving to start point. The drone will fly to our start point and start executing the flight route. Because we are doing an oblique mapping mission, the drone will fly one route and then the same route at a 90 degree angle. After the mission is complete, the drone will land back at the home point. Now that our flight mission is complete, we can take the data from the Mavic 3 Enterprise and process that with Pix4D-Matic. We're going to open Pix4D-Matic and drop the file folder with all of our images from the mapping mission into this screen here. Pix4D-Matic will take our images and overlay them on Google Maps. We will then begin the calibration process of the photos and then we can select Ortho Mosaic to process our final 3D model. Once everything is done being processed, we can view our final model. As we can see here, the Mavic 3 Enterprise and Pix4D-Matic did a great job at recreating this digital twin. We can also use this model to measure distances. Here, I'm measuring from the edge of this building to the beginning of the railroad tracks. I also measured the inside diameter of this baseball diamond. Overall, Mapping with the DJI Mavic 3 Enterprise and processing with Pix4D Matic was an easy to do process and the final result came out in high quality. If you have any questions on mapping with the DJI Mavic 3 Enterprise or processing with Pix4D Matic, go ahead and put those questions down in the comments. Also, be sure to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell to see all of our latest Drone Nerds content. My name is Matt, happy flying.